hey guys so today I will tell about the how to integrate um, Divola in your website or in a web page we will be doing the uh, sandbox environment testing uh, for the integration so as you know sandbox is a testing environment so this is the URL for sandbox uh, the actual URL is www here so we will be going with the, the sandbox first you need to sign up there and after sign up uh, you can uh, log into your sandbox account so I already have a sandbox account and so I'm going to log in So after the login, uh, uh, you need to create a application uh, that's uh, application uh, URL slash application. Okay, so uh, you can create a application here. I will just go ahead and first create a application uh, testing one two three and uh, we have a website here i will enter my website we have a, a callback url that is here and we have a url uh, thanks url here thank god that's email inventory text yeah thanks user registration email a verified text url yeah yeah you can enter this one here and well uh, give the permissions to it and create application okay we have the application here so after creating the application you need to get the get button code okay simple button free type amount button and uh, you can choose anyone from here which whichever you need and let's say pay now only product name testing uh, product description anything uh, okay retreat you will have a uh, five dollar and activate it so we get the code here but uh, uh, there's a problem I will show what's the problem so uh, enter the this code that you get here into uh, into the body after the body tag in your page and we will now navigate to uh, the button here yeah we have the button here now okay I'm doing fast because uh, this this is all all you guys know about but the problem is after this okay uh, yeah as you can see there's a error failure and the error description is invalid application credentials well well the problem uh, is right there uh, if you check the JS file uh, here and the, you will see that the uh, uh, find the www and you will see that the URL here is uh, uh, www.dibola.com and payment pay as as you know we are doing the testing so uh, uh, we are doing the testing means we there should be UAT so, uh, so because the application is created in a, a sandbox website so but but here it's www so we need to change this to UAT so that we can get the this error removed because uh, uh, they, uh, this is the actual website uh, the real website and the application is created in the sandbox website that's why this is given the error so what we, we need to do is we need uh, let's create a um, JS file devola.js let's just create it uh, on the same directory where you you have the uh, your web page or you can create it anywhere and just we just need to link them okay i paste the code here we'll find the www 
make sure you need to change the second www this payment fee enter ut here and save now replace this direct link with the vola.js just make sure if you would just this file name the file must exist in the same directory this is the my my web page and this is the file here if you are linking to uh, if you are uh, having up the js file uploaded somewhere somewhere else you need to put the full direct link here well let's save it and uh, okay let's save this one too uh, yeah i did okay now we uh, we need to check if it's work okay refresh and this okay and we see the checkout page so if you are having that problem of invalid credential this can be solved by doing this process well i had this problem that's why i created this tutorial to help you guys thanks for watching just minute